my name is Sandra Jean Sias. I'm a professor, I'm an artist, I'm an engager. As a creative, I've learned through my journey that God created me in a very unique and special way. I'm a person with dyslexia. We see things in different patterns or different perspectives. My mom said I used to scribble on the walls in my bedroom, in the closet. I was a, a born street artist. I've been fortunate enough to uh, be commissioned to go to various parts of the world to be the instigator of creating art with communities to address or advocate for a particular social justice issue. One of my favorite projects was um, a couple of years ago when the cartels were controlling the Juarez region of Mexico, and I took a number of artists with me down there to reclaim their turf. And we engaged the community through the arts. We uh, collected all the trash and cleaned up the streets, um, and we made art from the trash and made the area more beautiful for them to uh, feel their identity and to reclaim it. So for me, when I think of a social practice artist, we're kind of a catalyst for change. I really feel like that God created everybody very, very, very uniquely. And if you've been called and gifted to be an artist, we have a struggle and a battle today because the arts have been stolen by humanity and by the secular world. And God is asking each of us that have been gifted and talented by Him to reclaim that voice and to bring his word back into the beauty of life, into the works of art that you can share, whether it be in a social practice engagement or a sculpture or a painting or, or even just a, a way you communicate in a creative manner. God is calling you to use those gifts. He created you that way to serve him.